hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of t if we have 27 to the power of t is equals to t to the power of 9 and we solve this problem for all the values of t so you see here in the left hand side we have exponential term in the right hand side we have a polynomial term of degree 9 uh, so we find the values of t uh, here uh, we uh, need to do some working and the very first step uh, we are going to do is uh, here we need to move our variable terms to the right hand side and we move all the constant terms in the left hand side so now uh, first we move our variable term to the right hand side uh, so for this we need to take a teeth power teeth root on both of the sides or in other words we will take 1 over t power on both of the sides so we have 27 to the power of t and its whole power 1 over t is equals to t to the power of 9 and its whole power is 1 over t and here we use uh, the exponent law and you know about this life we have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n so according to this uh, exponent law uh, here we multiply these two exponents and these two exponents as well uh, so when we multiply these two exponents it will be written as 27 to the power of uh, t times of 1 over t is equals to t to the power of 9 times of 1 over t and now here further in the next step uh, here we need more simplification you see here this t and this t are gone and we will get here 27 is equals to so here again we apply uh, this law and according to uh, this law here we can apply this law from right hand side to the left hand side and now you see here in the right hand side we have in the exponent we multiply uh, these two terms so here we write the multiplication of these two terms in this form uh, a to the power of exponent to the exponent okay here you see that these two uh, terms are multiplied by each other here we move over 1 over t the inside the term in this form t to the power of 1 over t and we write it as its whole exponent is 9. So you see here we move our uh, variable terms uh, to the right hand side uh, and uh, now we have time to move the uh, constant term in the left hand side. So in order to move this 9 in the left hand side we need to uh, take the 9th root on both of the sides or in other words we will take 1 over 9 power on both of the sides so uh, when we take 1 over 9 power it will be written as t to the power 1 over t to the power of 9 and its whole power is 1 over 9 and now here in the left hand side we need some working here and we write this 27 as uh, 3 cubed and its whole power is 1 over 9 and uh, in the right hand side we need to multiply these two exponents according to the above exponent law which we write it here and uh, we write this term as t to the power of 1 over t and its whole power is a 9 multiplied by 1 over 9. So uh, here uh, we simplify the terms uh, and you see here uh, this is 3 times of 3 becomes 9 and in the left hand side we will get 3 to the power of uh, 1 over 3 is equals to in the right hand side this 9 is cancelled out by this 9 and we get here t to the power of 1 over t. And now uh, here we have uh, time to compare both of the sides so that when we compare its bases then we get here t is equals to 3 and when we compare its exponents then we will get here 1 over t is equals to uh, 1 over 3 okay so by comparing uh, both of, uh, of the exponent bases and exponent then uh, uh, we get here the same value and that is t is equals to 3 so t equals to 3 uh, be the only uh, one uh, solution of the given equation and now here in the next steps uh, we need to verify uh, this value of t so in order to verification of the value of t we need to copy down given question statement here it is 27 to the power of t is equals to t to the power of 9 so this is the our given question statement and now we uh, substitute uh, the value of t equals to 3 here uh, so uh, when we put this value of t on both of the sides and we check the behavior of on both of the sides is both of the sides are equal or not uh, so when we put t equals to 3 here it will be written as 27 to the power of 3 is equals to 3 to the power of 9 and now here uh, 
we do working any one of the sides and we get both the sides are equal uh, so here we we will do some working in the left hand side and we write this 27 as 3 cubed and its whole cubed is equals to 3 to the power of 9 so that uh, here in the left uh, in the next step uh, we again use the exponent law and we multiply these two exponents and it will be written as 3 to the power of 3 times of 3 becomes here 9 is equals to uh, this is 3 to the power of 9 uh, so this shows that uh, the value of uh, t is equals to 3 is satisfied over given question statement so t equals to 3 be the only one solution of the given equation and this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos